Hello, hello mga ka-partners This is your partner, Eric the Explorer And welcome to my channel I hope everybody is in good health I just want to show you my good uniform Do I look handsome here? <laughs> Actually mga ka-partners, I'm here in Princess Margaret Hospital because today I need to undergo to this endoscopy surgery because a month before they found out that I got a uh, gallstone or these uh, duct stones inside my gallbladder and that duct stone is already blocking in my bile duct so they need to remove it anyway last time uh, actually this is my third my third time already to undergo for this uh, endoscopy surgery if you heard about this endoscopy surgery before mga partners this is the latest uh, latest uh, instrument that they're going to insert through to your mouth through to your esophagus to check what is uh, inside your internal organs yeah and uh, last time they trying to dissolve or smash the gallstones inside my gallbladder but it's unsuccessful so they uh, insert the stent to help to smash or dissolve the gallstones so if it is successful then I no need to undergo for a major surgery but if not and then uh, they need to operate me manually so I hope guys that uh, it's, uh, it's uh, dissolved already anyway I trust that that it helped me to get well. So guys, I'm waiting for my turn. Yeah. And I've been waiting for more than one hour already. Keep waiting for a moment. Maybe soon it's my turn. So many people keep waiting too. We're all waiting for our turns. And we're in fasting, my partners. We're fasting from 12 midnight last night until now. No consumption of anything. So right now, I'm very hungry. No water, no food. And I'm prepared and ready for admission as well. Many people saying among apartments that it's not easy to to, to to feel sick here in abroad because your family is very far with you. But to tell you the truth, here in the hospital, uh, doctors and nurses are very, very good. We have patients to assist, to assist us everything you need. And they're very willing to assist you. So it doesn't matter if your family is far away from you. Yeah, because uh, doctors and nurses here is very good. 
everything you need. They're very patient to assist you. So don't worry, mga kabayan. If you feel sick, don't hesitate to come to the doctors. Me? So many, many sickness already. But they must, uh, I, I must undergo with it step by step. So for now, I'm still waiting for my turn to go to the surgery room. But before that, I undergo for so many examinations already. And I'm fit to be ready to do this. So just trust God. Keep safe. Because they always say prevention is better than cure. <laughs> Must be aware of that, mga partners. It's very, very useful to be cautious. I just keep on praying that that the stones in my girl brother is already being dissolved so that I no need to undergo for this major operation. I'm hoping my partners. But for now, the case is they're going to remove the stent that they insert in my bile duct a month ago. And to check if my gallstones are all dissolved or not. Because if not, uh, I'm going for an uh, undergo for this major operation. So, I update you guys later. So, help me pray. Help me pray that it will be Oh, it's very uncomfortable wearing mask. Hey, I allergy. I got allergy in wearing mask. You know. I update you later, my partners. Hello, my partners. First surgery is done, and actually, it's successful. It's already dissolved the gallstone, but not all. So I need to be get inserted again tomorrow for another stent because. It the extent they used to insert last time they didn't reach my gallbladder because there's a gallstone blocking in my bile duct uh, tube going to my gallbladder. So they dissolved already the duct stone blocking and for tomorrow they will insert again a new one goes to my gallbladder because there's a lot of dark stones there and I hope and pray that he will be get well again so they allow us to eat already my partners so I'm eating now vegetable this is vegetable so I'm here ready I'm in the ward now. I must eat now and then after after midnight, no need no need to no need to eat anything again. They won't allow us to consume any 
food or drinks after midnight because I undergo to endoscopy surgery again tomorrow for inserting another stent to my gallbladder. Let's eat, mga partners. Just now, they removed the stents inside my gallbladder and it damaged my throat. Yeah, then I throw up blood too, but now I'm very hungry. So I eat slowly, slowly, little by little. Because if I swallow, my throat is very pain. Before, I always deny what I feel. Even I cannot bear it anymore because I'm very scared. I don't want to go to hospital because what I know is hospital here and abroad is the same as in the Philippines. You need your family to accompany you every time. But here they don't allow, especially now pandemic, no one visitors. So it doesn't matter because nurses is everywhere. Every time you need something, every time you need their assist, they're willing to assist you. They're very helpful. They're very good. It's easy to approach them, even though they don't understand English. Because some, still some doctors and nurses cannot understand English. They are very, very good. So, mga kabayan, kung kayo nagkasakit, huwag kayong hesitant na pumunta ng hospital. Huwag kayong mag-worry. Kung malayo kayo sa pamilya, walang mag-aalaga sa inyo. Doctors and nurses here are very helpful. Okay, mga kapatid. Thank you now. Pray for me. But I can bear the pain again for tomorrow. It's not easy. It's very pain. I passed out again just now. And I'm very sure to tell you that I even passed urine on my underwear. <laughs> yeah, that's true. So lucky that I bring my extra underwear every time I'm going anywhere. So, our uh, partners. Bye for now. Thank you for watching. Please like, leave some comments, subscribe, and don't forget to click the notification bell for you to be updated for my upcoming videos. Thank you, thank you very much. This is Eric Explorer saying, don't forget to smile, be thankful, and keep safe. God bless.